Hello and welcome to the Hoof GP. Today we're looking at this cow who has a really incredibly sore front right foot. If you haven't already subscribed and you like these types of videos, then click the subscribe button down below. Maybe you think you've subscribed but you haven't because sometimes YouTube actually unsubscribe you for some reason. So make sure that button down there is grey, not red. In the meanwhile, enjoy the intro and enjoy the rest of this video. So when this cow was brought round from the pen to the crush, she could barely touch the ground with her foot. So I reached for the video camera and thought this would be a good one to see what we could do to make her more comfortable. As you can see, the first thing I did was wash her foot off, because I know you guys like it clean. It doesn't actually make any difference to me though, because the grinder cleans it up with the first couple of swipes anyway. Now if you pay attention here to the noise the grinder makes, you'll hear a different sound to usual, and that lets me know that this hoof is hollow on the inside. As with all trims, I aim to balance the claws first and make sure they're the correct length and the right angle for her comfort to be at its optimum. After that, I go to work finding the problem. And you may get halfway through this trim and think, ah, oh, the problem is not that big. But guys, watch all the way until the end and you'll realise that this problem is a lot worse than it first seems. For now though, I'm going to be quiet and let you guys watch and enjoy this trim.
So as I'm sure you'll agree, no wonder she was so lame on that front right foot. That must be incredibly painful. Having a white line defect like that, that is then completely infected by digital dermatitis, causes an immense amount of pain and damage. The corium, the bit that actually grows the horn, is completely overrun by spirochetes, which is basically what digital dermatitis is. Kind of little wormy type bacteria, corkscrews into the corium and attaches itself, and then destroys any new horn growth. So unless that digital dermatitis is cured, that problem will never Never go away but hopefully we've done it this time believe it or not i'm actually confident this cow will be going far better in the next couple of weeks so like i said in the beginning if you haven't subscribed you like videos like this and you want to follow this cow's progress then make sure the button below is gray not red for now though i'll catch you next time bye